Hey guys please watch my video till end because the quality content which I will provide you in or less than 3 minutes will be priceless and very useful to you it might change your life so I don't think you will skip my video so let's start the powerful video. An essential action on the path to self-improvement and more satisfying connections with others is coming to terms with the possibility that you engage in unhealthy behaviors or possess unhealthy features. The following are some indications that you may be engaging in harmful behavior. 1. Continual criticism. Asterisk it may be a symptom of toxic behavior if you are someone who constantly demeans, belittles, or criticizes other people. This can involve making derogatory remarks about their physical appearance, abilities, or the decisions they've made. 2. Manipulative behavior. Engaging in manipulative behavior such as, guilt tripping, gaslighting, or, using others for personal gain, is a toxic trait. Manipulation can also take the form of utilizing others for one's own gain. 3. Controlling tendencies. It is not a healthy pattern of behavior to make an effort to dominate or control the people with whom you have personal or professional interactions. This can show itself as excessive possessiveness, an attempt to control what someone else does, or a refusal to give them their own personal space. 4. Persistent pessimism. If you have a habit of concentrating on the unfavorable elements of circumstances, individuals, or life in general, you may be contributing to the development of a poisonous environment around you. 5. A lack of empathy is another prevalent symptom of toxic behavior. This can manifest itself as an inability or reluctance to understand and empathize with the experiences or viewpoints of others. 6. Jealousy and envy. To continually feel jealous or envious of the success or happiness of others and to express that jealousy or envy in a negative manner is a destructive pattern of behavior. 7. The chronic drama. It's possible that you're toxic if you enjoy stirring up trouble in your personal life or among your friends and acquaintances. This involves engaging in gossip, spreading rumors, or provoking unnecessary confrontation with other people. 8. Refusing to take responsibility. Blaming other people for your own mistakes or weaknesses and evading accountability is a destructive form of behavior. 9. Extremely competitive. Toxic competition manifests itself when what should be a healthy form of competitiveness becomes excessive, and when individuals are prepared to hurt others in order to achieve their goals. 10. Isolation. It may be an indication that you are in a toxic relationship with someone if you try to separate them from their support networks or if you try to distance yourself from friends and loved ones. 11. A poisonous behavior. Ignoring or crossing other people's personal boundaries Ignoring or crossing the personal boundaries of other people, whether they be physical, emotional, or social, is a poisonous behavior. 12. Frequent angry outbursts or temper tantrums. It is toxic and potentially hazardous to others around you to lose your temper on a regular basis, shout, or demonstrate violent behavior. 13. A toxic and hostile environment can be created by harboring grudges and being unwilling or unable to forgive people for the faults they have made. 14. Passive aggressiveness, often known as PA. A poisonous method to deal with problems is to communicate your displeasure or anger indirectly by using sarcasm, backhanded compliments, or subtle insults. This is a bad way to handle the situation. 15. Self-centeredness is a toxic behavior. Always putting your needs and desires above those of others without considering their feelings or well-being Putting your own needs and desires above those of others without considering their feelings or well-being is a self-centered behavior. It is imperative that you take action to address these warning indicators if you have recognized them in yourself. You can modify unhealthy behaviors and build healthier relationships by increasing your self-awareness, engaging in counseling, and making attempts to improve yourself. It is also beneficial to seek support from friends, family, or professionals to assist you in navigating and overcoming these inclinations. This can be done either in person or over the phone. Like, share, subscribe and comment.